Hello and welcome back to Joe and Al play Dwarf Fortress, the Deja Vu Challenge Mode. Deja Vu, I'm Joe. And I'm Al, and last week we were fighting against the game, uh, which means that all of the men we killed are now unkilled, Joe. Uh, I can't figure out why that is, but we have them all here in our drowning pool, and... I realized as I was editing this that there was a very simple solution to the problem we were having. <laughs> Didn't we do this one time? No, we did it. We built a floor over the the upstairs. Right. Did they climb which out? Which we I thought might have been enough. It was not. So we're gonna have them do this with our guys stationed down there. We could just like wall them in, you know, cask of Amontillado style. Mm-hmm. Uh, but I don't think we should. We built the, th the floodgate twice. Yes. We can leave their corpses down there and no one will ever see them, which will be nice. That is And nice. the other thing, when we crashed, we were working on the trap room. Right. Which I hope to go back to. That cat just climbed did, up. What did I build? It's me. You were <laughs> just kidding me. I just thought it was Why? the tile Why? I did too! Why is there a building present? I don't understand this either. What does that mean? There Where? is no building present. I had him remove it. Why are you building a kennel? Build kennel? It says open space. Okay, maybe okay. it just has a build, deployed. construct, floor. Oh, you haven't Why is there you a... haven't canceled the inner fortifications that you designated. What does that mean? I don't know. Well, you made this you made this shape as a fortification. Right? They built the outer ring, but the inner ring is still a fortification waiting to be built. So just X that. Oh, okay. I got you. Okay, that's going to be a floor now. Fantastic. These guys are... All right, not everybody's down there now. I have to go to the bathroom, sir. I didn't per give anybody permission to go to the bathroom! <laughs> oh, you boogers! Station, move. <laughs> it's cursed. It's cursed. That's what we get. We're trying to put women in Dwarf Fortress. We should have known. Ugh. Where is the rest of our guys? <laughs> They're just doing stuff. Hanging out. Militia captain is sleeping. All right. He's sleeping in the door. <laughs> Who said you could be here? <laughs> He's also the creator of nothing. Mm, yes. I don't know why I have... I'm just going to go ahead and, and do the thing. Let's see how this works. The other guys can get Atom Smashed or whatever. Bloop, 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 bloop. Come on! Die! No! <laughs> don't climb out! Yes, he's a corpse. He's a corpse. He's a corpse. Woo! Those are some corpses right there. <laughs> Let's put floor over this part so they can't see the corpses. Floor. Floor. It's a floor. <sighs> all right. All right. And we'll get their memorial slabs engraved or whatever. So they don't come get back as ghosts. I don't know why there's only two available. Maybe he hasn't been. They, maybe they haven't realized he's missing. We don't have any unengraved slabs. We were out of rock last time we met. I can't remember what's. We were out of rock. Which reality is which? It's so frustrating. But nothing is broken this time. Well, damn. I have this theory that uh, it's because I hit the button too hard. <laughs> Which button? Enter. <laughs> okay. Alright, what's the... Now, you were walking me through how to make the spikes go up and down. Right. First, you build a upright spike trap. So, is that a T and then a T traps, and then a, a, shift S? S? Okay, we had started on this. Yes. That's when I hit the button too hard. <laughs> Done selecting. And one of them crashed. Crashed. It was crashed. We have uh, me mechanisms being made pretty, pretty. How many are we going to need? One for each trap. 
Okay. And one for the lever. Uh, I don't know for sure how many mechanisms we have, but I'll make some more. Nice and easy. Just gently tapping the keys. <laughs> You're making iron mechanisms. That's not what we want, Joe. No, no, it's not. Yet. You're fearing the game. That's what it feels like. It feels like you're scared to tell the A little. I'm scared to, to be things. hurt again, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> I can't take it. I'm going to have the uh, rest of our guys stationed at the good old Atom Smasher. And l uh, this time we're just going to put uh, or pull the lever on repeat. Interesting. That's going to cause horrible problems. Those guys are on the it, wrong side of the... Though. I know, that's why they pull the levers on repeat. <laughs> That'll learn them. Oh, here we go. Nope. Yeah. He's just standing there, though, that one guy. It's on repeat. We don't have many dwarves, remember? Oh, there he goes. We have 16. These are my favorite. Yes, 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 yes. Kick yeah! him! Yes! <laughs> okay, we can turn that off now. Hey, no more men! Do we have a guy in a tree, or is that a different save? I think that was a different save. Okay. Or he's dead now. <laughs> I like the guy in the tree. It was very funny, yes. I think I just accidentally built just a random slab. <laughs> I don't see any problem with that. I just had a thought. Yeah? Um... It would be fun, because I was thinking the guy in the tree, they could have his corpse in a tree, be like a warning for other men coming. The slab should be like, lighting the road into the fort. Oh yeah, that's not if a we, bad if idea. If we run out of space in the, the garbage dump. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and remove this extra mechanism workshop. You've made uh, it! <laughs> yeah, you're a little... Why? Like, why... Why what? I don't know. It just doesn't seem to be in the way. I don't think it's doing anything that bad. We might build something else there. Maybe we'll do some smelting or something. You have all the space you need. I mean, that's probably true. Nobody's unhappy. No. The the ghosts are not real bad. That one lady who got haunted, I, we... Oh, that got... Uh. I, I'm, that was a different yeah. save, I yep, think. Yep, yep, yep. This is gonna we'll go ahead and work on making this room nice again. <laughs> Make that room nice again! Albert, 2020. I have limited goals. <laughs> I don't know about the whole of America. I don't know about great. But this one room! <laughs> we can look, make it nice. Look at the rock mechanisms. Yeah. That's cool. They're, They're pretty huge. cool. I mean, they look like little drive shafts or something. Yeah. Also, didn't we have 16 women? One of them might have been on the ramp. <laughs> right, right. I remember me saying at the time that it was a bad idea to put it on repeat, but you said I should just charge ahead. <laughs> I think one of the kittens got killed. <laughs> hey, we discovered an expansive cavern deep underground and a magma pool. That could be very handy. Let's not go in there. Now, in our Amazon fort, if somebody requests permission to stay with us and slay monsters... Oh, petitions? That's interesting. Yeah, but they're a man. No. Dancers, no? maybe. Entertainment? Oh, maybe? I like that. Okay. Not we. Uh, th this save does not have the nest boxes we were going to build. We might have built them, though. We actually... Yeah, let's try. Needs next... It is not the one. We could get a pulse explosion from this, Joe. Yes. Especially because, once again, you built more nest boxes than any fort has ever needed ever. Fort Egg. Didn't oh, you need don't need many. 20? I mean, how many... Uh, what are they called? Birds. Do birds? You, <laughs> <laughs> you forgot the word for birds? Listen. <laughs> we can look... At the slab, once we've memorialized her. Oh, look at that guy in the some neat tiles in this archer. Oh, it's the archer. Yeah, that's who's visiting. But he hasn't petitioned us yet. I guess he's... Yeah, he's a little <laughs> worried about being a male soldier here. Feeling a... <laughs> it might not be a male, to be fair. Oh, I thought you had looked. Uh, no, I haven't checked on that person. I can, though. Uh, that's a V, I think, to see a person. 
That's a Mace Dwarf, Melville. She heard this was a good place to search for monsters. Oh, neat. What about the archer? That's a warrior, Toad. It's a human bowman. Interesting. Now that's a man. That is a man. The plus sign is the vagina. Yes. That mnemonic Also, has you can tell by it says he. For five years. They're, they're coming along with their... Oh, I guess the mushroom is the slab the icon they That's have for carrying the, the slab. not the slab icon for carrying that I've seen, yeah. I thought that they were just, like, popping Pop into the room, their, like... Chewed on some mushrooms. Mm, this is a good burger. I gotta slap down this slab to my dead <laughs> husband. I don't know. All right. Uh, now, what do we do to view these? T? Is it T? Yeah, okay, here we go. Nothing it, about him. It's really a, lot of, a lot of information. <laughs> I guess when they just disappear without a trace, there's a... Creator of... Devoted father and husband. Creator of what? United with brass. I don't know. I saw that when he was in the What did any of that mean? Oh, the creator of nothing, Devoted father and husband. But what did devoted to brass mean? Lover of bucklers. Uh, I think it just... It's another word for lover of... United with giant Nautilus. <laughs> I people. don't think he's actually a hermit crab person, <laughs> Joe. people have nothing. I think that he it's just like... likes... <laughs> like, listen. What do you expect them to have? <laughs> it's like it's a have... gravestone. It's not like, a when biography. You walk, when you buy the slab, the engraver's like, look, you get 600 letters. <laughs> Are you sure all you want is father? It's like, ah. Uh, he like Nautilus shells? <laughs> I don't know. We don't know much about the guy. Dress. The guy drowned. He did not go missing. Mel Bill wishes to reside to eradicate monsters. We will approve her. We will deny Toad. Uh, you know what I'm going to do? Somebody built a bunch of downstairs here, and I'm going to try to <laughs> this out. Just another, another section. We're going to finish up our spike weapon trap thing. I don't know what you nice, call it. Nice, nice, nice. I think we could, like, smooth and engrave this. Death view. You absolutely can. It's like a really nice death room. Mm -hmm. You have that power. I'm also thinking about engraving our communal bedroom and our temple. Mm -hmm. We only have 15 dwarves, but that's enough to have a few of them engraving, I think. And we're not... I'm also a big fan of beautification. So, and the early temple, a really nice early temple definitely helps even out the moods. Hello. Hey, some migrants have arrived. All we right. Can, uh, let's see if we can get how many men we have after a minute. The, uh, and we'll hopefully the spike could put our be. spear trap spike to work. Yeah, mm -hmm. only five this time. Okay. Let's see. We have Keep in a, mind. A legendary woodcutter. Excellent. That uh, man can chop a tree. Or, sorry, that woman can chop a woman? tree. Woman! <laughs> also, legendary bone carver, which we could put to real use if we did some butchery Keep and in stuff. mind, kids aren't on that screen, so it's possible we should check every... Well, I guess we check it often enough. We decided that we weren't going to kill kids. Well, no, but they might age up into adult males. Well, but we'll see them when the new migrants yeah, arrive. I agree. We'll, we'll check off enough. Well, this will be good for our uh, defense situation. Mm -hmm. Yes. I like to think... I've, I've started... I used to be, I thought of these guys as a nuisance. Like, why do I have to deal with these people applying for citizenship or whatever? But that's actually pretty cool because then you don't... like. They'll function as sort of an ad hoc army. Do they? Well, they're there to def eradicate monsters, so if a monster shows up, they'll definitely fight them. Oh. All right, check out the spear These room. These guys are still down here. <laughs> it is partially smoothed. Oh, that's we definitely smooth. want to build our... Oh, okay. I want to see, because it's... I don't know if those are done yet. All right, spikes up, spikes up. Okay, you can throw down your lever. The last square needs to be done. Probably by the stairs, somewhere busy. Oh, that's a good point. Yeah, okay. Lever. Let's put it in the temple. Oh, that's There's always so, somebody in the temple. That's so wrong. I don't know if they can walk over it. I don't know if they can walk over it. I don't know if they can walk over it. Oh, is that in the door? It's blocking the I'm door. Sorry. I guess they could go diagonal, but that still seems a little... No, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was looking at the little square there thinking that was the door. You know, I honestly don't know. <laughs> no, you're right. You're right. You you, you, you tracked it. There's a, There's a... That adds a wrinkle that's just horrifying. What? The fact that the liver's in the temple? It's like that, that experiment where you, you have someone and you tell, tell them to push a button and every time they do it, so you have someone in the next room scream. 
Do you don't explicitly say that the button is doing anything? I remember that. And then there was like, people were like, yeah, but maybe they can tell it's fake or something. So then, then they rewired the test. So it had actual, like, zapping people with electricity. Really? There was a and brief somebody said, of time. you know, that's kind of messed up. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe that shouldn't be allowed. There's a brief period of time <laughs> there in the 70s where psycho, psycho, psychosociological, whatever the word is, tests like that were, uh, Woo! Anything goes. You don't, you're no longer allowed to have... <laughs> cause trauma to people who think they are torturing someone in the room next door. How did this get built? Oh, oh. We're waiting for mechanics. Well, the other guys will just stand by the... By the other thing until we're ready for them. What's this room underneath the bedroom? I think that was going to be a... Like a food place hmm. I think that was my plan for it let's go ahead and crack that open to see if we can make that happen can people walk through tables I think so some people would have lined the uh, longer wall I know and, ha and had <laughs> people face each other when they eat that's not I'm not about that Joe <laughs> come to Albert's where you won't have to deal with any people uh, social distancing <laughs> is the name of the game right now <laughs> in these trying times joe <laughs> we're all pulling together to ignore each other <laughs> to ignore each other <laughs> somebody was saying like well if you're gonna say pe reopening the economy might require some deaths you're gonna why don't you just take your family and feed some people in a very crowded area and i was like I would take my family and put them on an Alaskan, like, crab boat to get them out of the house right now. <laughs> you have no concept of what it's like. <laughs> Someone told me we're running out of meat. Uh, it's probably not a running out thing so much as the supply chains are, like, weirdly specific. Like, there are farmers that... Meat is starting to be affected. Farmers that grow potatoes for only McDonald's. And so yeah. if McDonald's supply needs go down, then all of a sudden those farmers have giant buckets of potatoes that they can't I'm gonna go sell out on to the anybody. Limb and say that that's larger than a bucket. Also, we're a, a tote, a thing. It's like a huge, <laughs> it's a pallet box of potatoes that you can't sell in that. a supermarket because nobody can use. Can you unpause the game? I'm thinking about linking up our, uh, our, our oh, spikes. Well, do or do not. Gently, gently. Oh, oh, you're right. Oh, my goodness. <sighs> <laughs> just just tap it. Nice and easy. Uh, so, uh, AD is going to be a crab fisherman, huh? Oh, no, I mean, it's too far to drive. <laughs> he can make his way there. How old is he? It's about time. Uh, seven? Yeah, he can make his way to Alaska and become a fisherman on a crab boat, Albert. You've coddled him long enough. He's been gaining some weight. I keep like pointing out like those cocoa puffs you're eating have a lot of sugar and carbs. <laughs> like looks at me and just like keeps eating. He'll ask if things are healthy. I'll tell him that and he'll be like, I'll eat an apple afterwards. <laughs> That's not how it works, man. <laughs> <laughs> Balances it out. <laughs> <sighs> I have to take responsibility though because I'm the one ultimately who's, you know, buying the food in the house, so... Nah. Uh, it's my fault he's fat. We'll go ahead and make this our di a bedroom. Or dining room, I mean. Uh, meeting hall, yes. Could mm -hmm. make it like a tavern. And this one should definitely be smoothed. And we need more smooth. beds, I think. We're low on people? beds. Are we? The whole killing off we have half 24 the population. people. Okay. It's not the, like, the usual population Even if explosion, they're all happy sleeping in a... A bunker or whatever... The uh, words they, they all need to have one <laughs> with Albert. Words with Albert. Okay. Back, but I'm hey, it looks like all of our stuff is linked up. So let's go ahead and have our squad. We'll pull one, pull it, do a test. Oh, you just want to see if it does the thing? Yeah, I like to see them all go down. Good chunk. It. I don't have the sounds set up, Joe. Oh, I made that sound pack for you. You special and everything. You have to make the sound then. Good chunk. There you go. Perfect. Did they all do it? There's this one that's like a weird 
Retracted spikes, retracted. They all, they look different. Interesting. Okay. Can they stand on top of the retract like the spikes when they're out? Uh, I would pull them in to station them. I don't know how that would work. Okay. They might smell a trap. No, they can't smell a trap, but that still seems like it would perhaps cause some problems. Perhaps. Perhaps. Oh, it's dodging trading, boys. But it never ends. But it never ends. There are two ways out Actually, of this room. Well, no. There's one way out of this room. I guess you can lock the door, too, once they're in. Oh, could I? You're I thought the dwarves through. could always get through a door eventually. No, you can definitely block doors. Have I looked around for... Do we have anything like metals and stuff in here? Phylite does not have iron in it. Phylite, phylite, conglomerate, tetrahedrite. Whoa, tetrahedrite? That's a metal, right? Yeah, that's copper. Well, we'll make something out of copper. Alrighty then. All right, all right, all right. I had a, a lot of fun. I was editing your uh, totally reliable delivery service video, and you got into like a weird mental loop where you were just saying, "All right, okay, all right." During which part? All right. I don't know exactly what you were trying to accomplish. I just know that you said, all right, all right, all right, three in a, three times in a row, and I just like put up the ding sound effect in a picture of Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> I, don't, like I, I do things, I don't know if anybody else will find them funny, but I find them hilarious. Why aren't my guys stationing here? Man, I don't know. Are they active? Are, are they, they active? Whatever, are they guarding a burrow? Are they furiously trying to axe through that floor you built to save their drowned comrades? That would be hilarious. Uh, let's see. Let's go into our list of citizens. Maybe I, didn't, maybe I forgot to put them in the... Yep. The livid vaults. I forgot to commit. Uh-huh. That's what happened. Okay. Here they come. Everybody going to stand in there. One, two, three, four, five. Nope. Don't go out. <laughs> Are they all in there? Uh, Pause. And they might be two on one tile. <laughs> Add new task, pull the lever, do task now, repeat. Yay! Now we can see both sides. Excellent. Of the experiment. Of the horrible, horrible experiment. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I was not expecting that already. Ooh, oh, God. Chunk. <laughs> oh, and some the cats strength. were in there too. Chunk. Oh Chonk. my god! And they're fighting they each all other. Gone? I c cancels. I'm, what? <laughs> Experiencing emotional trauma. Let's make sure <laughs> that all the men are gone now. This experiment was yes! dangerous. Oh my god! This is awesome. I love this. What's our next plan? Those we brought... were there wooden spikes too. That was supposed. To... Oh, maybe it's because they're like the menacing. And not wooden spears. Okay, but here's no, but seriously, that was those were. I don't have any more killing plans, and somebody's gonna go, show up next season. You gotta go to lava. Okay, yeah, we found lava. That's a good point. Or dig a big hole and make a retractable bridge over it. What, just like shut them in and let them starve? No, then you station them on the bridge, and then drop them. Right. Okay. A long way is. Do I have to like? <laughs> Oh, 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 you want, like, a tower. Like, they fall off of the tower and just fall to their death? That kind of thing? Well, it, not a tower, because you dig a hole down. I mean, that's a oh, little I like bit semantic. Idea. Okay, you can build a tower. It might be easier to I, dig I've a hole. I've had my though. fill of, of outdoor buildings at this point, but if you're still raring to go with those, yeah. I'm gonna, big, I'm gonna dig a door here. Supposedly, in this cavern, we have lava somewhere. Really? That's what I'm... Uh, so let's search. Lava... Nope. Pool? Magma pool. Here we go. Zoom to it. Huh. It's right here. How far down is that? Uh, it's... You can see the numbers on the right of the screen. It's either 106 or <laughs> 16 or something. <laughs> I didn't realize you had gone that far down. Well, it's... Let's see. So it actually... Is on this next level so we would need to dig here an up down stair up down stair i want it this time for real <laughs> that's what i was laughing at oh i've got auto mining on <laughs> so it's stupid okay remember when i taught you that 
how to do auto mining? I remember, yeah. yeah. It just took your member saying, and now to get off of auto mining, you hit A. But what will actually happen is you'll attempt to dig something out later on, forgetting it's on, get really angry. Because <laughs> that's what always happens. That's about as. It must not happen to everybody, Joe. Probably not everybody, sorry, but that's how I remember auto mining is on because I sit there going, why aren't you mining? Wealthy cats. Rocky, Philly, and Uda. <laughs> that sounds like a. I'm back on fancy cats or whatever her That's name is. That's a man. That's a lady. Philly's a lady. Uda's a lady. Philly and Udi are ladies. Uda are ladies. <laughs> is Rocky is a lady. <laughs> Rocky has a pet dog. <laughs> Udi lives in a red house, but is not <laughs> They next travel to toward each other at 60 miles an hour. <laughs> now, we do have more slabs to make. <laughs> I like how we're just leaving that room. No one's ever gone uh, in there. <laughs> they, nobody can look in there, right? I l actually like that idea. Yeah, that's not yeah. the worst idea. And we'll dig out some stuff here. Because we'll need more room. For the endless slabs. We talked about building them in the, on the way. Mm -hmm. That is so gruesome. I can just was about to say, I can't pay attention to what you're saying because the spear room is so horrifying looking. There was the one pull, room? right? One and done? I did it go up and down a few times? Um, I kind of was aghast and screaming and hiding my head when the uh, first one went up and the cat exploded. Oh, man. No, it happened at least a couple times because the... Okay, the menacing hazelwood spike... Oh, but there's nine of them or ten of them in each one. Ten so... in each square, yeah. I mean, it's a... So, hazel... A... This is a hit. This is a hit. This is all one hit. This is one hit. Let's see... That, that's well. It looks like two pulls. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, and then double that number. So in two pulls, all that happened. Oh my god! I don't know why this person's sleeping on the floor. <laughs> plenty of beds. Is it a visitor? Whose bedroom is that, by the way? Who gets the fancy bedroom? Have I not made this a sleeping area? <laughs> I'm so I say this every time, but that tickles me so much. That they were sitting next to a bed. It's like, this flat wooden surface with the comfortable things on it. No one's told us what to use it for yet. <laughs> I haven't given the bedroom to anybody yet. I'm waiting for somebody to tick down to yellow so that I can... Look at this guy happen. farting around there. Yeah, look at this bed. Yeah, it's not for you! Has any of our stuff got... Why is our miners not doing anything? We might have other things being dug. What do our stocks say? How many picks do we have? They're weapons, It doesn't show picks. Oh, is it under a weapon? I think so. <laughs> All you have to do is designate a bookkeeper. I have one copper pick. Okay. So that's not the problem. Okay. I don't know. I'll give up, Joe. Yeah, we won't need to mine any time in the future. That should be fine. We'll buy some from somebody. Speaking of which, how's our food going? Cancel spawn on any of our meal stuff. <laughs> yeah, you're just, there has whatever, we're not mining anymore. Unrotten cookable item. <laughs> I the food is more important and you know it. <laughs> Didn't work for just than mining? <laughs> yes! Hey, there's my asthma in that room. Good. Can't see that horrible. One of the things is just terrible. It's like a dead. I've got to look around here and see if the, uh... Cat, I think? The pickaxe made it in here. Oh, yeah, maybe they were, uh... Yeah. They might Person have been who their... has to go in here. It might have been their weapon. I can grab I any weapon I want to them. go train. Oh, God, no! If only we had some sort of keeper of books. Who could then tell us where things are. I'm getting them working. I don't know what to tell you. I've, I've got the stuff going. We haven't had any traders in a little bit. We're coming up on the fall, I want to say, is our next season. Yeah. Okay, there's a lot of people standing next to that tree. Where? Right there. They're on the screen right now, in the top-ish. Oh, okay. Right now. Do you have a fruit thing designated? Uh, Maybe. Let's see. It tends to, it tends to do this. Yeah, gather, pick fruit. Do you have fruit? Are they do like? Are they getting stuff, or...? Uh, well, this tree right here is... Go to your stocks. A ginkgo tree. Great. Go to your stocks. There's a stand. Yeah. They're not doing anything. Well, why are they standing there by the tree? Because the fruit picking is a little borked in this game. Oh, is it? Yeah. 
I can turn that off for now. I I stopped doing fruit picking. That was also about 11 of your dwarves, so it's possible some of the labor... Somebody was just standing there holding a pickaxe, looking up at the ginkgo trees? Quite possible, yes. <laughs> Will there be fruit soon? <laughs> <laughs> I'm really looking so forward to some of your OAC fruit. <laughs> Some people eat acorns. I know. That's why I... Sw well, I think we've also said there might be something you can eat with ginkgo. So I didn't want to um, go there. It was a perfectly good Listen. <laughs> I'm trying. You're out of rock. I know! <laughs> These guys are probably having to eat or something. Everybody's happy still. Yeah. So you've never seen a fork ground to a halt because of a lack of rocks. It's a new one. It's pretty bad. <laughs> You've done it again. Watch in wonder and amazement as Joe and I'll show you things you did not know were possible in Dwarf Fortress. We do not mean that in a good way. And I think we should wrap this episode up after this save is done. I'm refreshed by the lack of crashing so far. <laughs> you just have to taunt it, huh? Like it doesn't have any balls anymore. That wasn't what I said. <laughs> I mean, we can probably start the wrap-up now. Oh, okay. We're going to do something huge right after the save stops? I don't know. Probably not. <laughs> I just feel weird about it now. <laughs> well, we are finally saving. We're heading into the autumn, and that is going to wrap it up for this week. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm so thankful that we finally got to do a couple of really cool kill-offs. Our Spike trap room was Lops. absolutely awesome. Yeah, if we get, of gore. it occurs to me, Joe, that we could mm -hmm. just ha mm -hmm. like we talked about a starving room. Yes, we could st station some men in that room, and yes. then just shut the door again and have them surrounded by the horror and the filth. Yes, we could. I think that might be something worth. I doing. would forbid everything in there first, but yes. That yeah, 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 yeah. Before something. we open the door, but that'll do it for this week. Thank you so much for watching. The Cavi Pup is starving. We'll see you next time. Goodbye.